Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another React video. We have another Hiroyuki Sawano track today. It's been a hot minute since I've listened to him. By that, I mean like barely a week, but to me, that's a hot minute. And we're going to be listening to K21 today. This is one that of only a few people have added to the list, and I've just kind of let it sit at the bottom for a while. Figured by now it's high time to finally get around to it and give it a shot. So let's do that. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> this is completely I expected orchestral. This isn't orchestral. This <laughs> giving me kill a kill vibes. <laughs> He's bringing back those old days, huh? Ooh. Hell yeah! I'm a sucker for that Tom Groove. Is this actually the same? Is that the same uh, rap artist that did the Kill a Kill soundtrack stuff? It's it's been so long. It might be. It's a very similar uh, a tone in his voice, at the very least. Was a fun little like slide dip in. Okay, <laughs> that was a super fun fill. Ooh, the double pedal! Yeah! You see my chair rocking, I'm, I'm mimicking it. Hell yeah! <laughs> that was dope as fuck! <laughs> That was super fun. Oh, I want to go back immediately and go listen to that uh, one fill in here. Oh, it's just... <laughs> that is so fun. It's, just, it's, it's like a lot of, like while going down the, uh, the toms and like just going around the kit on all the uh the snare to the toms he's like using uh flam doubles all the way down and just kind of like finding a home row basically that's <laughs> that's that's a fun fill i love that that is super fun that whole like last fourth of that song is just so much fun with the drums it's <laughs> it's like sawano is just like hey drummer play it <laughs> just fucking let him shed all over that kit that was super fun i was right i just looked it up it is the guy who did before my body is dry same guy it sounded so much like him okay cool awesome 
lo- I've always loved his lyrics, lyricism that he's got. Or, or just, it's so very straightforward, and it just b- brings you right through the story he's trying to tell. There's no like, like side tangent bullshit. It's just like boom, here's the facts, here's the words I'm trying to speak, and they're done. You know, I thought it sounded a lot like him. Must have been. You know, I it, there was no other way. <laughs> But yeah, holy shit. I didn't expect uh, that out of it. I expected another um, uh, more orchestral sounding thing. Because I've, I've almost become accustomed to hearing that. Because Sawano's tracks that I've heard are a lot more of that recently. Whereas Yamamoto is usually the one that's kind of playing with that uh, new age bend a little bit. But it's nice to see that Sawano still goes to that when he feels it's necessary. So just super fun. It, it felt like something straight out of uh, Kill a Kill, which is a great nostalgia trip for me. And I love the shit out of that. Thank you very much for uh, anyone who's put that into the list, even though it didn't get that many compared to other songs. If I may be so selfish, I'm putting that in my top five. So that's... I'm going to have a good rest of my day after listening to that one. <laughs> and I will see all of you in my next video. <gasps> Goodbye! <laughs>